seem like my life been really changing on me I know some niggas out here hating on me Ay, I see the bitches how they changing on me I know some niggas out here snaking on me Ay, see like Yeah, yeah, yeah Fuck is you talking about profit? My niggas get it and you ain't got nothing My niggas they thumbing through hundreds AR's revolvers, you know that I'm clutching Them niggas ain't clutching on nothing You want my head, but nigga come bustin' My niggas they thuggin' Well shit, here we are, bro, what's the goddamn deal? Shit, just chillin', you know Welcome to High Tings High Tings, man High Tings Where we talk about every bumper clad thing <laughs> <laughs> And you gotta be high to talk about the goddamn thing Only high, that's the only way yeah. So shit Shout Start out it off. You know what I'm saying episode So look one. This is our episode one This is our intro This is our everything You know what I'm saying We was just literally Talking about doing the podcast Probably like 30 minutes ago And I was like My nigga I got everything So he's like fuck it we got Let's just go ahead And just do it You know what I'm saying He so, got his mic I got my recording mic and, You know So I got another microphone too though That's in the closet That has a, a Shock mount And stuff like yeah. that Right there That we could I, I mean yeah, but Chris, it's a cheap ass. You would think like I bought yeah, that like this one. It's like, cheap, and it's a podcast. I bought mic. it like for twenty dollars though. It's a recording mic. Like oh, uh, and you bought whenever, it for twenty? I bought it for twenty dollars, and whenever yeah, like yeah, I don't cheap. have this, like I always carry that microphone everywhere. Like whenever I know I'm going to a studio or somewhere, yeah. like I mean not to a studio, but like to somebody's house or something like that, I always carry the microphone, and I just yeah. yeah. Cause sometimes I don't want to bring this microphone to people's nah, houses. Nah, cause that's like expensive. expensive. Yeah, they break that, but you gonna be mm-hmm. mad. I'm gonna be mad, man. So look, our podcast basically is just talking about everything that's going on in the world. Just why you hot? That's the only thing. You know what I'm saying? Just talking about everything while you hot. Whatever latest is going on, whatever we got going on in our life, whatever the fuck it is, we just gonna sit here and talk about it. Exactly. No holding back, no nothing on anything. No sugarcoat, nothing. Nothing. Which I can't. we don't sugarcoat shit any goddamn ways. That's just how life is, you know what I'm saying? It's but shit, sure. how you doing today, bro? Shit. <sighs> Took it was a journey today. You know? Yeah, yeah. It was a long ass day, bro. We try to leave to Oh, you talking about the cop situation? Yeah, try to leave. <laughs> hey man, shit. We always fucking have situations as cops. And you know, niggas, I don't want to bring this shit up to say it's a race thing and everything else, but y'all already know what the goddamn business is. It, it sucks sure. having to go through what the fuck we go through when it comes to cops, bro. Like, yeah, man, and I, you know me, I'm, I ain't, I'm not scared to admit to it. I am scared of the laws. <laughs> they kill people, they yeah, got yeah. guns, they got tasers, they got patons, and it's just me. You know what I'm saying? So I can't, and then if you hit them back, you know, uh, that's, yeah. uh, you can't, that's you not really self defense. And that's, that's just stupid. That's because assault you can't on do a peace shit. officer. You feel me? Yeah. Like, but that nigga hit me in my face. They can and do they, whatever the fuck they want to do. He me and all the, he, man, I got a black eye right now. He ain't got nothing going on with him. Man, nah, and but, if you do, it's just gonna be goddamn hell and war, and, uh, or you going to jail? And there ain't no hell or war. It's jail. Or, <laughs> and that's it's, hell or war. It's jail or hell. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's fuck it. All shit. That. You either going to jail or hell, because he's going to kill you for hitting him, or he's going to take you to jail for hitting him. Either way it go. Yeah, but but even if you don't do shit, that's yeah, still y'all kill could your come and me. Y'all could come run up on me. I could be walking down the street, or just like just like earlier, we walking outside, get to the truck as soon as he touched the door handle. Yeah, he, nigga, cop gonna stop. <laughs> hold on. Hold on, hold on, like hold on, damn, do bro, we ain't even doing shit. And he sat in the parking lot for at least five, ten minutes. Nah, he sat in longer than that because we was on the phone probably five, five, ten minutes. You know, <clears throat> yeah. I came upstairs. Man. Yeah. I'm going to the mailbox. <laughs> this nigga gonna say, "Hey, bro, go to the store, see what happened." I'm like, nigga, because he's like, I'm gonna go to, go to the, the I wanna go to the store with shit. Go, yeah, do that. <laughs> so basically, he like, my nigga, go ahead and see if you get pulled off. If you don't go to jail, then we can come back. Like, nah, if nigga. you don't go to jail, you come back, then we can go do what we originally we gotta did. Do, yeah, yeah. But other than that, you know. What I'm Man, somebody got to be out here. Somebody got damn me. Yeah, tell him you would rather the truck to be in the parking lot, leave the key in there, and I come gladly pick it up 30 seconds after y'all leave. <laughs> I'll be waiting. <laughs> and I'm not pulling up. Nope, not right there, because I know why right they there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shit. Let's go ahead and like these goddamn sweets, bro. Let me get that lot after you. Oh, man. That's how you doing me? I try to trade you. Nah, that's all good. Trade me. Nah, I'll take this one. I ain't gonna tell y'all what the nigga did. It's a hole in there. It's a hole in this bitch. What I tell me. Nah, that's shit. cool. I All want right. it. It's Look, mine. I got. I got. I could patch it up real quick. Let me see a piece. You got a piece? Yeah, yeah, I got a piece. Come on, 
I mean, my finger could do it too, but shit, if you got a piece, I'll go ahead and you pass it. just lick that hard. I ain't licking nothing. Patch, nigga, you know? what the but fuck? I'm just saying, it's a I little crusty. I taught your ass how to roll. It's what just a little you crusty, rusty, you feel me? So I'm just letting you. Know. age was you when I taught your ass how to roll? Man, we bro. can't even talk about that shit. <laughs> <laughs> that was not a condone its age, you feel me? Uh, you like, right, you right, you right. <sighs> But yeah. just know it was young, 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 young. It was shit young. crazy. So for all y'all who don't know, I'm John Marshall Productions, and I'm Kobe Bain, and we're family related. This is my little cousin right here. Yes, my real brother. blood family. People are like y'all really blood. Like, y'all real this blood. and that. Yes, <laughs> real fucking blood. I can officially say yes. This is because you know in the streets or just out here, everybody, everybody, and shit. everybody, everybody your cousins and brothers and yeah, you yeah. But no, we brother. really blood. Yeah. We got the same goddamn blood type, like real top. I don't know about the blood type, but the, the, we same, got the same blood, blood. run through. Oh, yeah, yeah, nigga. The same type of blood run through both of us. Ain't no I put whole that in the shit. Middle for me, please, if you don't mind. Hmm. Oh, y'all can't even see that on the second one. Yeah. But yeah, so shit, man. Like I said, our podcast is just gonna be talking you know, about. We got the high tings uh, ashtray. Oh yeah, you gotta have the high tings. We're gonna oh, have I, merchandise I got my coming. I don't know if I brought my nigga with me, my other Rastafari. You don't know Ash Trout? Oh, yeah, no, nah, I don't know if you brought your Rastafari. If I did, right. I'm gonna pull him out. I don't know if I got him, though, but shit. So, bro, since we on, since we talking about that, what you think of the goddamn. I hate to do my nigga like this, what, bro. Nate? Ah, I hate to do my nigga like that, man. <laughs> <laughs> what you, you know, think, like, bro? <clears throat> You seen the fight, right? Yeah, I seen the fight. I seen like did I ain't you, gonna say you I see, ain't see the fight. I seen the like your reaction to the fight for sure, but I seen like little bits and pieces because you know I'm not really into like everything that's going on right now. I'm not really into like all the watching the sports and all yeah. that because you know like everything is all entertainment or about money. It's not yeah. what it used to be, and no, I'm kind of it ain't what it used to be, bro. I'm kind of I don't know if you seen what Floyd said or not, but he was like uh. I ain't seen it. He told he told Nate he was like, "Look, man, you, I don't know what's wrong with everybody else. You know, like they downing you and they bashing you because you're a basketball player. You got famous off of playing basketball. Yeah, you didn't get you famous. got your riches off of playing basketball. Yeah, so that's not you his lane. To, you were just like Conor McGregor. Yeah, you got famous for fighting and stuff like that, but you came and stepped in my ring. Yeah. Logan Paul and Jake Paul, what they do, they train for boxing. Yeah, they already been, been boxing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Doing it. He just, like like he said, if you looked at the numbers, like what they made, like $600 each off the fight. This, That's how this, it was? Yeah, something like they like uh, Tyson and uh, what you would call it, made a meal. They made like six hundred dollars. Can't can't be no six hundred or like a hundred something. I mean, can't be. They got to be more than that. Pull, look, we could pull it Let's, up or whatever. You yeah, know look, what I pulled up right here. Yeah, and uh, like, but they got more money off of just other shit. That's just like the main. You know what I'm saying? Well, of we course, they up, got, how much they made? How after much? Fight? Yeah, how much Nate Robinson and Jake Paul made off the fight? You know, Jake Paul gonna make more because he won for the show, for the show. But. uh... Let's see. Uh, damn, it do say six hundred. I tell you, six hundred dollars. Yeah, that shit say only made six hundred dollars. Only made six hundred dollars, and honestly, Mike like, Tyson versus I, Roy I, Jones Jr. fight purses. Legends make over one million. Jake Paul and they rob them just six hundred. How the fuck does nah? Because they well, made look, money off of other things. Nah, though. I was gonna say the only like, they made much six hundred off of what they probably what paid, they, but them niggas what, probably made M's, the, the M's and shit yeah, off of that shit off the side sure, bets and everything I know else. Nate Robinson, Nate said that he ain't do, he doing it for his kids and the money and yeah. all that shit like that. This and that. Man, you got a million, more than a million dollars. I'm just gonna say million dollars because I don't know his contract or nothing like that. But oh, he, he bread it's bread. over the million. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He if, if you less than a million, he still playing? He should be. Yeah. Let's see. We can look. You see sweet. Jake Paul wear his jersey right after he whooped him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm sorry, Nate, man, but I did make a reaction. If y'all ain't seen the reaction, man. John Marshall Productions on like, YouTube and shit. Comment, hit Please the do that. We got, we're trying to run boy. it up, man. Like, we're running everything up. Our whole go- focus and everything right now is to just put our hands in everything and make shit jump. Just, we make t shirts, we make videos, vlogs, photography, podcasts, YouTube channel. Goddamn! Uh, for sure, for sure. Uh, anything, M- music, video, yeah, music. We make you music. We make pictures, beats. We make beats. All that shit. We do I it all. Record you if you want to hop on a song with me. We can do it. I'll all, show you man. how to start businesses. I'll show you how to do all that shit, man. Like, music wise, for me, for features, I'm not charging nothing. I can't charge. I can't say what this man charges for music videos. I could do my verses for free though. Yeah, hell you know, yeah. Because. 
You could be yeah, all yeah. the way in Nigeria when they get on a song with me. Send it Send over. Send it over. <laughs> and we will get, get on it. Yeah, I'm going to get on and it. And if we can get a goddamn... Uh, what's that shit I'm thinking for? Uh, passport. If we can get the passport, and if we can go goddamn overseas and go shoot the video, we'll do that shit. Or send us some footage. And we'll shoot some footage and we'll merge some hoes together and we'll make a goddamn video. It don't matter. However, yeah, we yeah, gotta get it done. If y'all record a video and y'all just ain't got the editing scheme or just y'all just ain't got half of what it takes to edit this shit. You send know what I'm saying? Send it over. Shit. John Marsh, <clears throat> it's John's Tube 19 at gmail.com. Or it's uh, And it's Kobe, K O B Y, period, Z A P A T A, 1017 at gmail.com. Y'all saying anything y'all got? Y'all want to talk to us about anything? I need help on anything? Need any type of advice? Anything you need? Just email us, man. For Check sure. us all the social media out. Kobe underscore Bang. Goddamn John Marshall Productions on everything. TikTok John Marshall Productions one, but you can find everything. And you can find me on everything TikTok and social media, whatever. Just mm-hmm. all gonna be the same. It's Kobe underscore Bang. There's only one of me. And if there's another one, please let me please know. Please tell that nigga he's an yeah. imposter. Nah, we do not know you. Let him get the clout off me, because he really helping me out. Yeah, because he helping. Yeah, they're going to be like, who is this nigga really? Yeah, and they be like, who the real? Bang, nigga. You know what I'm yeah. Da, 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 da. Just like Rick Ross did. Just like Rick Ross did. go to YouTube. Oh, so this like is really Kobe typing. Bang. Yeah. <laughs> I like them sound effects. Yeah, <laughs> it sounded like you was really typing. I try. I think it said high tings. High tings. What made us call it high teens? Mm-hmm. Honestly, this nigga came up with it probably like, like I said, we just talked about this shit. 10 minutes, 30 minutes before, before we, we started, started this shit. <laughs> he said high teens. I was well, like, really, fuck we it. left. <laughs> he was like, let's start a podcast. And like, what, how, what are we going to do, man? High teens, man. We just go get some, some smoke, whatever. You know what I'm saying? We just talk high. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, talk like, about everything that's going on. And then we came here. We was chilling, and it came up into the wind again. It's like, man, let's make a podcast. Man, we gotta have every man. No, we don't, man. It's high teams, man. This is all for, all, all for you. <laughs> and now, look, this is the first episode. We gonna throw that hoe out there. See yeah. how it work, man. I want to keep passing them that, but that's not what we doing. This I forgot one. I had a sweet. I that's didn't even go much like, lighty. I forgot I had a sweet. I'm still he lit. it up and he's still smoking. I finna put mine out for a second. God damn it. I think that's why I put it to the side because I wanted to save a little bit of the shit. Damn, we already see. almost twelve minutes in. I ain't even realized that's that. What I'm saying I ain't halfway. trying to save nothing, but shit, I've been trying to. You know, nothing. like when you smoke, it's not nothing. It's nothing. Nothing. We ain't trying to say nothing. Mm. No way. So, since we're doing the podcast, let's talk about your music, bro. You got some new... Well, we just dropped... Well, I just dropped yeah. I'm single on your page. Not yeah, too long John Marshall Productions. And uh, so, that's out now. I'm single y'all remix. Go, I'm single remix. Y'all you know, make sure y'all check that shit out, man. It's a good-ass video. we have some originals that are finna come out pretty soon. It's some new soon. shit. Some he new just, new like, shit, literally, like, like, the nigga will sit here... And we'll he'll hear a beat or think of a beat in his head, make the shit, automatically think of some shit in his head while he making a beat, sit there and hit the mic up, and then boom, he got a whole goddamn song within hours. Not even hours. Really, it don't take him that long. If you make a beat, it's going to take some time. But if we got the beat, that nigga will literally lay that bitch out within 30 minutes. Like, literally. Off the dome, no pen, no pad, no nothing. Finished. That's finished. That's laying it, ad libs, everything. Yeah, finished. <laughs> everything. I, I, no Every- phone. I can't pick up a phone. If y'all don't know, some people may know me, some people don't. I can't. I, I have a dyslexia. It's a real. It's a disorder with reading. You know what I mean? So like words move around, pop out. I, when I was in school, I had to have a. I don't know if you know what it's called, but it's like an overlay. You put this sheet, you know what I'm saying, over it. Normally, some people use one sheet. My ass had to have two different colors, you feel me? My shit blue gray. You know what's I crazy? Because growing up, like. Gray then blue. I ain't know that, you know what I'm saying? We yeah. family family. Like, I never knew that, you know what I'm saying? I was always going based off of just. Vibes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm not going to show nobody I'm dumb. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's not even just being you dumb. You ain't dumb. Exactly. I'm not dumb because, like, it's I'm just one of the like smartest everybody people has that they... people, like, like I say, I ain't go to, I ain't graduate, right? Yeah. I got this lecture. Oh, this nigga ain't graduate, and he can't read. That nigga dumb. No, I bet you I could school you. Like you all, I'm not saying I school you, but you all the time. I give you good ass advice all the time, and it's like, and you tell me, nah, you, you, you cap, because I'm finna tell you what you tell me. <laughs> Damn, it's crazy how young you is, and your mind's like that. Of you course. know what I'm saying? And yeah. your mama tell, told yeah, you that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's why yeah. you know what I'm saying because I'm not dumb. Nah, you've always been the one to just, listen to a lot of shit you know, that I would like. Instill into you and teach you, and then my mom would tell you some shit you always listen to. So, and then it's not like, and then it's, and then it goes beyond that. You know, it goes beyond you and your mama. 
it goes beyond y'all. I was gonna tell you the same thing, but oh goes, yeah, when I turn, yeah, when you yeah. turn like that, but okay, it go beyond your mama. Oh yeah, you, my mama, my daddy. It's I go like like for instance when we were pressure washing that store the other day. Oh, what and, a situation and, and that, that happened. That situation that man came up was crying. Man, so look, ah, this nigga came up, I man. He had rice. gashes in his hand, man. Like literally, like he had blood all over him. He had no shoes on. He would he tried to act like he was crying. He did the shit twice. I told my cousin, I said, nigga ain't even crying. So and my I told cousin, him, I told him like, got stop on his that ass. bitch ass. He's like, man, stop that fucking crying because you're not even crying. My nigga, like, you ain't even doing shit. So he like, shut the fuck up. And we got in his ass and we was telling him, like, bro, all that shit you doing, like, you obviously did something that you weren't supposed to do because you don't but want I the broke police it down to be caught. He, he, like, John, he was like, he was getting frustrated. But me, I like, I was. I, I, ain't, gonna I, lie. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not gonna say I like that type of shit because it's wrong. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. To say, like, oh, I, that, I look forward to somebody coming to me <laughs> like that. You feel me? I'll fuck up and you know what I'm saying I doped out but I just like I kind of have a thing with like helping people you know what I'm saying really not even just you know what I'm saying it's gonna sound wrong but I really like to school people because you know yeah. I growing up I always been the black sheep of my you know what I'm saying oh, my family they and all that shit. You like shit I hate that but it, it, it be like where I'm like you know what I'm saying all right bet this is where I can show my intelligence you know what I'm saying? Bet yeah. I could, I could. You know what I'm saying? I could yeah. help this person out in front of you, and you could go back and even if you don't go back and run and tell somebody else, you feel me? But at least yeah. you know what I'm saying. You got, got to, to see, see it that I ain't dumb. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And the, the I store, never thought you was dumb. But the store dude, he was like, when, when we finished the job, he was like, yeah, oh, no, yeah. that I thankful, thank you for that. I'm like, thank you for what? And he's like, for for what you said today, because that I meant a lot. I wonder where that dude is at right now, bro. I, he probably I told him he needed to go to a mental hospital he, he said, and rehab. Yeah. He's talking about he wanted to go to his job that his old job and shit. Like you job. can't go to like like that. Cause I told him fuck that job. Especially I said, the way you is, bro. Cause this go for anything and anybody. This I had to learn this myself. In order for you to get better in life, you got to better yourself. Exactly. You always have to better yourself. It, it, like say like in a relationship, for me to love somebody else, I gotta, gotta love, love myself. Myself. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Because I may not love myself because the person I just got out of the relationship with is not loving me how I felt I should be loved. You know what exactly. I'm saying? So I may be depressed or anything like that. And yeah. you know what I'm saying? And some people it's hard to me. Oh, I'm not depressed, man. Shut your ass up. Yeah, you is. You just don't want to say that I shit. I just you know seen what I'm a post on Facebook. Shout out to one of my friends because I ain't gonna lie. Whenever I was going through my shit, she uh, hit me. I don't know her first name, but her last name Sanders, a little black chick. She was talking about depression is real, and I just hit her up. So I'm, she might even hit me back already, but she, depression is real. That's what she posted yeah, on Facebook. Yeah, it is because like when I was going through my, I mean, cut you off, but like good. when I was going through my shit, bro. Whenever I, my my girl left me and took my kids and shit, yeah. I was really That's depressed. I was just gonna talk about my situation. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So like we could relate, bro, because I was really depressed. That's why on some of my goddamn reactions and shit, it uh. Close for the past you that hoe. Man, let me write mine there. Let me write mine. But yeah, so some of my reactions nah, and shit, I'm like just literally, to you cause I'm tired of motherfucking goddamn. <laughs> I, I I I hate smoking alone, you know. Yeah, I mean? like yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah, we don't. I, I don't. I don't. If I smoke alone, like literally, you know, I I buy the most expensive, and it's not trying to brag. The dopest about smoke, the that dopest you dope you can ever, ever smoke. smoke. <laughs> you hear me? And like, and he ain't lying. Yeah. Nigga, I always tell people, bro. When I ain't mean cut you off, sorry, but I always tell people, I don't give a fuck what weed you got. You'll never get the weed that my little cousins can get. Never, yeah, I, never. I, it's not even on no status. It's like everybody's like, cause my mama had to accept this. Cause my mama used to tell me growing up, cause I used to ask, cause my daddy an alcoholic and my mama is an alcoholic. I used to ask him, why do you drink so much? Yeah, and she'd tell me, and it used to hurt my feelings. And she used yeah, to be like, I gotta she drink. Through, yeah, right? she's like, nah, she's like, I gotta drink to deal with child. And I'm yeah, like, which is who fucked is up because like, it's because not you only really dealing with me because these are your golden childs, Br my big sister and my yeah, big brother. Yeah, but you know she not gonna just say you. you she, gonna she gonna say, say y'all. So yeah. I'm like, that's what I'm saying. It's hurting yeah. my feelings because I'm asking you, but you saying y'all and you lying to me. Like I'm, yeah, I may be young, but you lying to me like I'm dumb. Yeah, I know what you're saying. You drink yeah. it so you can deal with me because yes, I have ADHD. Yes, I motherfucking be funny and I. It's not being bad. It's being me. But you know one thing I want to say, regardless, my nigga, out of like you, the youngest, out of goddamn you, Judah and goddamn Brittany, bro, I ain't gonna say you the smartest, but you the smartest because my mama tell me you that know, all the time. You know what you want in life, and you stick to that shit, and you really pursue your passion. And it's not Them niggas did a lot of different shit. They not gonna chase their passion like that. I'm not bashing my little cousins. I promise you, I'm not. It's just on some real shit. I'm gonna get this nigga his props because. He yeah he said he got you know dyslexia all this other shit but this nigga is smart as fuck like the nigga is really smart as shit 
when he's put his mind to something, he's really on the shit. He really does what he's supposed to do. So I commend you for that shit because regardless it. out of, uh, you know, Judah went to goddamn okay, put that down, the man. Navy and shit. We got this too smoke. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Judah went to the Navy and shit like that. That's cool, whatever, whatever. You know what I'm but saying? that's not what he wanted to do. Nah, he just exactly. did that so, like. Because he could. Nah, and it's to, not to even get, just. To get him. <clears throat> to get. Like, to me, I don't mean to, because I know he going to hear this. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, he might, I, I, but he might who not, knows if he listens to the whole thing. <laughs> but, like, uh, you know. I feel like me personally, and I tell everybody this, and you could ask like T. Saying, I tell him shout this because we T-San. talk. Yeah, shout out my bro. Like I feel like he run away from his problems a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like Brittany always got help, <laughs> so she never had to run away. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Never. Me, I never had help. Uh-huh. But what you say, everybody, where you from? What you say, he from everywhere. Why? Because wherever I had to go to get it in and provide yeah, for myself, he did, he did what he had to do. I, I went there. Yep. Even though leaving people, all my best friends, my I leave my girlfriend. Yeah, but it's a lot of people realize it. you got to sacrifice some shit to get your life yeah, together, exactly. bro. Exactly, that's why I'm and saying. I leave, to... I leave who I'm getting it in with. And sometimes you don't I, even I mean take, to leave, leave people the pleasure, like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I leave the pleasure. For the pain? For, nah, not even just the pain because, you know what I mean? Pleasure comes with pain too. Yeah. And leaving the pleasure come with pain you're gonna have pain but i i I like on a sense of like i leave the pleasure for what's more beneficial you know what i'm saying like say if over here i can make this amount of money but over here i got this bitch and yeah she got a job and yeah i'm we barely we barely making it you know what i'm saying yeah i could go over here and really make it you know what i'm saying Mm -hmm. me and you ain't got nothing Ain't really much nothing for us anyway because what are we doing for each other? We're not bettering each other. Yeah. If we was bettering each other, then then maybe I'd sit there and I'll go through the suffering and all that other stuff of struggling and shit like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And that's what girls fail to realize because girls want a, a nigga to come, uh, or not even just a, excuse, you know what I'm saying? A man. When we say nigga, we, mean, we don't mean black. We, yeah, we, he means man, period. Man, period. Yeah. yeah. Uh, like, one thing for sure is like two things for certain. Two things for certain, <laughs> exactly. Is that you know, like I'm not, I don't have everything, and I know that. But you they look me? at us like we do when they yeah. see the shit that we have and exactly. the shit that we do. They come here and see all this shit, the iMac, the goddamn everything they see. They, they see think us that we in got. public Versace shoes, yeah. Robin jeans, yeah. chains on. Look, I just found this in my Robin jean jacket. Ring, I forgot that I fucking had. I like that ring. I ain't gonna lie. I like that ring. You know what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? If you don't mind, can I see that hoe? Yeah, push your show. I wanna see if any of these motherfuckers fit on my shit. Yo, Peaky. Ooh, I love it. Ooh, bling, bling. Yeah, y'all need to give me a Peaky ring, though, but I ain't much like uh, But that's what I'm saying. Like, I forgot that I I reach in my pocket and I'm feeling a ring and I'm like, and I, and Did I, I get married? Nah, I know I got <laughs> married I to the, nah, it. I know I got married, but it wasn't to no girl. Uh, but I got some, so many. Game. Yeah, to the game. I got so many pockets in this bitch. It's like $800 the jacket. Robin Jean's jacket? Yeah, this one yeah right bro. Let's see if I can do this smoothly. Without I fucking did. something up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, I got so many pockets in this bitch. That shit crazy. That's an $800 jacket? Mm-hmm. Why? The name, the material. What's the material? You do know? Let's say it. You said carpet. <laughs> it look like some kind of school carpet shit, nigga. Yeah. You know that little school carpet in the stores when you walk in the stores? It look carpet it's like nigga. wool. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like wool or some nah, shit. Nah, that shit probably way more popular. Excuse me, potent than wood. But shit, hold on. See, that's what I'm saying. You got to zip it up right. See? Damn. Got double zipped on that hoe. Yeah, double zip on this. Oh, you can zip it up or down. Yeah, zip it up or down. Got you. Mm-hmm. Nice little jacket. On some Drake shit. You know, but like I said, I got so many pockets. I got two pockets right here on the side. Then I got a pocket right here. You know what I mean? And I'm like, damn. And then this like this. You feel me? It's, that means it's really all the pockets. You know? Ain't no inside pockets? And they, they don't come with inside pockets. Damn. I go grab another $800 jacket. <laughs> it ain't going to have a pocket. Oh, it's going to have two pockets right here. That white one? Nah, that... uh. No, that white one. That, I remember blue. that white one. Yeah, the, the yeah. white one, I like that, hoe. That's my Billy Jean jacket. That's my, my thriller shit. Hey, man, pick that jacket up if you don't mind. I think it's on something. Yeah, see? <laughs> but, yeah. It was... 
He wasn't lying. Nah, hell no. Nah. I gotta look out for my nigga, bro. Damn, we already at 24 minutes. Damn, we damn about to be done with the podcast, nigga. Five uh, more uh, minutes. We gotta keep it going. It's been good. We just, look, I'm, we gonna let you know. It's gonna shut off and shut right back on. You oh, know we gonna go an hour? Yeah, we could go hours. All right, we'll just do until, that. until really, you know what I'm saying? Until we done talking. Until we done. There's a lot of things to be talked about every day. Okay. We might get some shit off our chest today, and then tomorrow or the next day, we might have a uh, whole hour of discussions again. You about know what something saying? else. For so sure, because we, so, we ain't even finished what we was talking about. We just kept on going. What was we talking about in the first place? We were talking about how I said that my brother, he run from shit and shit oh, like that. Oh, yeah, you know yeah, we were talking like, about the, our family, man. I ain't going to lie to you. You were saying that I'm running the, like, I, I'm smart, I'm yeah. the smartest, and that's what I was saying. Like, my mama, I always, that's one thing that my mama did tell me, because even when I was down and out, she did tell me, like, I don't know why you are stressing, because you, out of all my kids, I know the only thing I worry about for you is what? Going to jail. Why? Because I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna do anything and everything but to go you get it. Do what you do. But I'm gonna have to do what I have to do. That regardless, yeah. you know what I'm saying. Sometimes it might not be what I want to do, but that's yeah. what I have to do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. And I might have to move a certain way, and then I might get jammed up being over Which here. I hope not. End up being over Which here. Which I'm glad I'm here. Cause if all you niggas trying to jam my cousin up. I'm here. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it's not even just necessarily with a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Just be prepared. Just, just anything. Yeah, just anything. Yeah, you know anything. what I'm saying? I may, I may like, for instance, I may be on probation. I'm not saying that I am, yeah. saying, but I may be on probation, and I can't leave over here. And then I go to fucking Kentucky. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? To do a feature with somebody or make a music video, and then we end up just getting pulled over. Yeah, yeah and then, you're supposed to be out there. I'm not supposed to be out there. I'm yeah. on probation. Run my name. Woo woo. Hey, uh, now I'm in Kentucky jail. Racist in a bitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Then got to get expedited over here. Oh, nah, I ain't going to let you guys try it. I'm going to have to get if expedited. I got to break that goddamn walls down. Whatever I got to do. Shit, you my just nigga. Just you make sure out. that you have my location. Because I'm like, out. as soon as he asks for my name, I'm giving my name. I'm going to. I'm giving my brother's name. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm fucking nah. around. It's all jokes and games and shit like that. But I'm just all saying, like, this is just you got to get it in, Javi. You got to get it in. And got I'm not you. saying good. And not uh, all money is not good money, and all no. money is not bad money. But it, it, it is. There's no but such thing as money. There's no such thing as good money, and no such thing as Speaking bad money. Because, that. like you said, money is money. It's all got to be made. Mm -hmm. Speaking bad of you saying good. that, how is it that? Just, just, just all an example. What's up? How is it that? Uh, okay, so your grandma, just say any, not not your grandma. Just say, we just we even use, just say, nah, no. Nah. Okay, use my grandma. Nah, I know, but that's my my auntie. You know what I'm saying? Care. But I, I'm saying I ain't never had no. Well, maybe because y'all y'all cool. So say for instance, nah, because she she would be cool to shit. So say your grandma, <laughs> so say your grandma tells you like, hey, don't be selling that shit in my house. That dope money. I don't want that dope money in my house. But at the same time, I don't want that dope money in my house, but I need you to go to goddamn Walgreens and go pick up my motherfucking medicine. Yeah, That's the biggest that, goddamn dope that, dealer yeah. in the world. It's Walgreens. The yeah. farm, farm, the farm, big pharma. That's the biggest shit in the world. So how's it that? Show. So how's it that? Stay off that. A fucking. How's it that? Like y'all. How's it that? That's, like, like that's why you said with the good, all money ain't good money. Hold on, like all money ain't good money. You know what I'm saying? So how's it that your grandma could tell you, hey, don't bring that dope money in my house, but send but you to the goddamn store right to right go get this me. dope. That's bullshit. Yeah. Like I and gotta understand say, that like, shit. You'll sit there and give all your money to a goddamn doctor. Your doctor tell you this and put you on this and put you on that. But you won't think about, okay, well, if my grandson or my goddamn whatever, nephew or whatever, sitting here and he's I'm selling drugs and shit, like, it's the same fucking thing. At least he's doing it for the house owners, coming to the house. So you're paying some goddamn body else that's for their drugs. Else that's, that's not even going to benefit else. you. That's why I don't understand that shit. A lot of, a lot Man, of grandmas all, ain't going to get it's that. All, it's all a business. Like, speaking of dope money, it's all a it business. It is a business. And, like... I forgot what state it was, but it's a state in America, bro. I, we could look it up, nigga. They just, le they just, they didn't legalize. They decriminalized, nigga. You could go get caught with crack, and you is good. I heard it's about that. It's decriminalized. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm saying. Like, remember what you finna say, cause this bitch finna stop. I want to restart it over. All right. Oh, shit, this a real hood podcast. Nah, for we sure. This. this is 45 South. <laughs> you heard me? <laughs> but this is high team. But uh. What I'm saying is, uh, like, okay, so like, like I just said, they they decriminalize crack and shit like that. Okay, like with some some things, some things that some people don't, uh, 
some things that some people don't uh, realize or understand is that uh, <coughs> excuse me. some things that people don't realize I like heroin yeah heroin is actually like it, no matter how bad it sounds oh you do heroin but it's actually a good drug if you do it right fuck you mean nah, I ain't never done heroin or nothing <laughs> nah, like heroin that heroin nah, nah, heroin is, yeah. is actually heroin is in a lot of these pills that you're taking meth is in a lot of these pills you're taking if you do heroin right yeah. it detoxes your body basically hibernates your body yeah. and cleans your body out and all this shit and this and that that's why people get addicted to it because they hear about it and like oh let me try it then it's just such a, you're like on lean or something like that I you can't feel do me? it bro me neither fuck that I'm not, I don't give a fuck my body weed. gonna be dirty as fuck as it could be weed. Fuck I'm not, hey, if I want to clean my body, I'll go take a shower. <laughs> for sure, for sure. If yeah. I want to clean my body, I'll take a shower. I'm never yeah. going to do no shit like that because it's my pride. But in all actuality, that shit is actually good. Doctors would tell patients, go do some acid. Uh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Just yeah. like how we saying acid will bring something out you. It will bring this stuff out you that you needed to bring out you that you knew you had it in you, but you really did it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. like that. And doctors will really tell you, like, hey, have you ever tried psychedelics? I have Fuck is you talk about something? Me neither, but yeah. I'm saying like, fuck is you talk about have I tried a psychedelic? Yeah. It's like, yeah, look, I'm gonna tell you, go home and take this, this and that, da, 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 and don't be around no negativity, <laughs> a positive day, hey, and hey, come yeah. back to me when after the day after you take it, come back to me, I'll be here, and tell me how you feeling in, you depressed? I'm like, what? Put that tab on your shit. And, and go trip for and it. And move on. Go goddamn yeah. way. Yeah. Like, and then, uh, like, like opiates, like lean. That's liquid heroin. Yeah. I, I ain't gonna, I used to love the fuck out of lean. I used I've to be. I've done it twice, bro. I be, First I time then, well, let's see. I think three times. First time then, no, I think twice. First time didn't work. Second time got me. You did it with me before? Uh-uh. Crazy shit about it was, I did it, uh, shout out to your sister, Brittany, because, uh, I had did it around the time I think I was living in Bama. Yeah, y'all was in Bama because I, I don't know if you are y'all were there. She used to live in the Bama. I don't remember how, I don't remember how that go, but she yeah, had called she me because she wanted her. some liquor. Let me tell you how fucked up I was, bro. She called me because she wanted some liquor. She's like liquor. She's like, can you come? Uh, I remember I'm gonna that. come pick you up. I remember that. And she's like, yeah. In the white Corolla. Yeah, she's like, I can pick you up. Yeah, so go in there. I want some margarita type shit. So my That's dumb the ass. Day she got her ass got motherfucking jammed up. Well, hold on. So my dumb ass, bro, she take me to the liquor store. I remember the liquor store. Right? I forgot that Washington, bro, <coughs> which is right in the corner from uh, my yeah, baby mama's state. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I know what you're talking about. And um, I go to the liquor store, bro. I go in and she's like, give me some margarita shit. So my dumb ass, instead of getting some margarita actual liquor, I got, I got the, the margarita mix. mix. <laughs> <laughs> a big bottle of that shit, bro. Spent all the money all on that money, shit. All the money, nigga. So she didn't even know, bro, until she got to the bar. She's like, oh, shit. My cousin got the goddamn mix. mix. Where's I the was, liquor at? I was leaned out, bro. I was sitting. She told me straight up. She's like, I'll never, ever ask you to do something for me while you like that again. Because that was my first time ever doing it, bro. I was sleepy as fuck. I ain't like that shit. I ain't gonna lie to you. It's not even like like me. I I you can act like we me and T me and you T C N had a conversation about, about that. About the shit, yeah. I, how I was I I used to be on that shit bad. Like you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I got my studio. You was on the bad T-San. bad for real. Man, I was on that shit bad. T C N T C N and he my huh, he my brother, but he doing what he's supposed to do. He doing what I would do. Hey, hey Kobe, I got some motherfucking goddamn drink. Shit, I'm trying to get in the yo. <laughs> oh, bitch. Fuck it, bring it on through. Come on, you know what I'm saying? And I be like, and it got so bad. Like I was talking to a boy from yesterday where we did the reactions to. Yeah. Uh, shout Griffin. out to Griffin too. Yeah, shout out. Uh, I was talking to him nigga. bad, nigga. You fuck with you. <laughs> that nigga ain't gay, but he all know. I, I used to sip that shit straight. Like that's how bad it was. Like, I got a partner like, in, in Boma like that, bro. He, he that's yeah, bad. Like you know what I'm saying? That's bad. I don't I, know if he sip it straight, but I know he always sipping nah, that shit. I'm talking about straight, like. Why Fuck though, like, it up what like made this, you want that shit like that? Like it just like you know, like I, you know me as a smoker. I always been a smoker, that's it. and that's crazy because you drink, bro. And I'm like, yeah, how the fuck I do you drink, it. bro? Yeah. You were never a goddamn drinker. I ever. used to discriminate. This nigga was never a drinker. I used ever. to talk shit about, and, and you know what's crazy? I used to talk shit about alcohol, and my mama and my daddy and everybody was like, "All right, when you become an alcoholic, all right, when you become when you start drinking." All right, and I was like, man, nah, fuck You'll that. Never come I never alcoholic. become an Told alcoholic. Told me the same shit. But I'm not an alcoholic though. No, I'm well, not we a drink. I'm not. We a, drink. We, we drink, but I'm not an alcoholic. Yeah. Yeah. I do drugs, but I'm not a drug addict. 
Yeah. That's the difference between me and my brother or me and my sister or me and a lot of people. Yeah. And that's why I, I move where I move and I could do what I could do because, yeah, I may have addictive personality. They would say, oh, well, you have to stop smoking weed. It don't matter. But the thing is, should... it do matter, Excuse but me. it don't matter. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because, no. like, I used to, like I said, I got ADHD. I used to take ADHD pills, you know what I'm saying? And then my mama, you was, I think you was, uh, you was staying with I was us. around the time when, yeah. Yeah, when we first yeah. came back out here. Well, no, actually not nah, when we first, because when it, it was a two-story two house. Two-story house. Yeah, two-story exactly. house. Exactly, that's when I started getting caught up, not yeah. taking my pills, you feel me? Yeah, and that's when your ass blow. was, motherfucking got everybody in. scared. Yeah, Look at this thing, I don't know if you, well, this thing got everybody, he don't want to kill everybody with knives and shit. Man, that's because got y'all fucking running. everybody running around the motherfucking don't house. Don't fuck with me. The body's gonna die, Man. bitch, I'm gonna change it out, hold on. Don't fuck with Before me. Before we speak, you need um, some other shit, and we not getting, you know what I'm saying? What's up? Ain't it right there? Nah, that's how I was looking. It was just down here, though. Oh, uh, no? It was, though. It's plugged in somewhere. But I did take it out, though. Hang on. It's right there behind you. I'm looking dead at that Ain't bitch. Ain't that that motherfucker. I'm looking dead at that bitch. Yeah, you know what it is. We're going to have to record it, but we ain't We're going to have to, yeah. We're going to have to record <laughs> I got that blue. blue. Hey, I still got, still got that blue. You still got the blue? <laughs> I Nah, I know we like get back on the camera. We talk about some other shit, but you yeah, still got the blue. I still got the blue from the other day, <laughs> hey, man. So for all y'all who don't know what the blue is, man, that's gonna get you there. It's gonna get you if right. If you can't get there, it's gonna get you there. It's a dick pill. It's, it's a my own. Your, it's under your uh, right, wheel. You gotta lift up your tie. I say huh? your tie. <laughs> hey, I keep it clean though. Them hoes got rims on it, nigga. Yeah, that's why I said I got tie. them tools. I, I looked at the rims. Them I like got them threes. tools. Nah, I think they nah, tools. They, they one and a half, you but you keep them clean out. You got a ruler. Yeah, they about do. one and a half, so nah, I give you that. Yeah, I was finna say that. Hey, but I keep these hoes clean. But you keep, that's why I say you keep them bitches clean, though. Them bitches is clean. <laughs> so you back got the lay back. You got the lay back seat right there. I mean, ah, uh, nigga, don't make me hit the. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> you don't even see them no more. I'm back. That's what I'm saying. Like I ain't even. I ain't even got. Hold on a minute. Don't fall, nigga. Uh oh. Hey, he back. Right, I'm back. Yeah, I mean, but, yeah. but shit, speaking of that blue, it's a dick pill. We don't need shit. We shout out to goddamn uh, uh, Achman. 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 Shout Achman. out to Achman. Achman. That nigga was cool. I he got you. Know say, I was just looking for what the fuck I could light. Like, uh, all right, I got you. I got you. you, you we got lighter. the lighter too. I got it. It's somewhere around there. I ain't got that hoe, bro. You got to have that hoe. You was the last nigga to have that hoe. I got that motherfucker. No, you did, because you lit your sweet. But it was not. I got my keys in the motherfucking pocket shit. Shout out to the motherfucking gate key. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, the shout out to everybody key. doing podcasts. But look, you can see the motherfucking goddamn me. On the inside? The jeweler. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah, you can't see it. Uh, Diamond oh, yeah. Boys. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah, you see that. Uh, yeah. That's what's up, bro. If you don't want it, I'll take it. Yeah. I might give it to Put you tomorrow. Put on my pinky. <laughs> I might give it to you tomorrow. It's depending on how I'm feeling. Oh, we might fuck it and go to the mall and shit. Get some. Nah, we go. Nah, that t-shirt shit coming first. This, duh, right what the fuck? You yeah. know what I'm saying? Duh, I'm Shout out to the t-shirt that's business. That's what I'm saying. I might stay up until 12. Fuck it. That's <laughs> how rappers do. Lately, what you mean? It's oh, 10.30. Yeah, I thought it was later. Really. You know what I'm saying? Nah, not 12 shit, tonight. Nigga, what 12 you mean? The, morning. the past couple of weeks, bro, we've been going to nah, 6, 7 no, o'clock when, in the morning. When you left for Beaumont, I didn't go to sleep. I went to sleep when she texted you during the day and was like, tell Kabe to call me. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's because I had just went to sleep for about an hour and then I, my phone kept blowing up. And I was Rip. like, fuck, man, let me, my bad. I was like, fuck, man, fuck these hoes. You seen I got these hoes, oh, nah. Oh, yeah, I did get yeah, these hoes for me. free. Yeah, mm-hmm. you was with me at the store, huh? Yeah, Paxson. Uh, shout out Paxson. I just came up on a dumb ass. <laughs> <laughs> I got some pants for $4. Yeah. You hear me? Four dollars. I got some pants for four dollars, and I got one buy one get one free. These was the cheaper end, so these were free. Yeah, this nigga into his fashion shit. Yeah, I am into some fashion shit. Shout out to Versace's. The verse. <laughs> nah, to everybody that that motherfucking rock fashion and every you know what I'm saying to everybody, man, it's okay to to what get what you could get. It's not okay to rock that face. What's talking about fashion wise? Yeah. Fashion wise, it's okay to rock what you want to rock. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody could afford what I afford, or not everybody could afford what. Yeah, I take this. I'm about to say, because if not, nigga, I'm a, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we can go get some beer or something. Nah, I don't know beer. how much I'm not even leaving. I think I'm finna pull this, but. 
I, I think I still got a Bud Ice from last night in there. I'll drink. That's what I'm saying. Fuck all that shit. I mean, you know what I'm saying? You know, I might as well just take this shit as a shot. What, that nigga? Like, motherfucker. That's a little baby cup. A little baby cup? Look. Hey, I'm a drinker, nigga. I was talking about that. No, I'm flying. I thought I had a grab. Fuck it. Hey, no trash get back in, nigga. So I said, fuck it. But, uh, nah, like, for real, that, like, back onto, like, the ADHD pills and shit like that. Like, Are we going back to that? Yeah, back to, you know what I'm saying? We yeah. always got to come back to something, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, like, I smoke, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I drink. And I was I supposed, supposed to, to stop, stop but, but I can't. can't. <laughs> I'm a dog. I love hoes. I think I should go. Some, some, and like no. hoes. <laughs> uh, remix. Cause uh, Kobe bang on this, this bitch. bitch. <laughs> Acapella. Shout out my fella. Uh, I don't give a fuck about no weather. <laughs> I got the fur. Screaming fur. Make but, it work. <laughs> make it twerk. Uh, shake that ass. Uh, shake it ass. Don't drop that glass. You shake, shake, you shake that ass. <laughs> and them titties. And make them jiggy. <laughs> nah. Get with me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. You get the skin. But now, nah, like, for real, though, it's on some shit, like, where, like, that's been me, though, like, always in my life was, like, the outgoing person I guess you would say like I always you always wanted more in life I, not even yeah I always wanted more in life but it's yeah. even bigger than that I always wanted to do something with your life with my life you yeah. know what I'm saying you be knew something. as a kid that I you was it. always gonna be a star a star exactly just like I did I knew nigga been on bro I used to tell my mom all the time I'm gonna be on the team I'm gonna be on the screen I, look I, it's gonna be sound on the bad TV. what's it's gonna up? sound bad but what but my 7th grade art teacher maybe it was my 8th grade <clears throat> he was Judah teacher at first. She was the art teacher. She, you can ask my mama, nigga. What? She, t- I, I, she tell me, but I think I believe she told my mama too. She said I'm the devil child. Right then and there, I knew that I was destined for something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Cause like, you the devil child. Not even just yeah, because you know you when you think of the devil, you think of like Illuminati and all that other shit, and just like think of different. You think you're different. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like wrong. You know what I'm saying? And I yep. right, like I always yeah, like you said, I always tell my mama I want a big booty black chick with a grill in my mouth. You should say big booty black chick. Man, and I don't even like black girls. You know what I'm saying? Nothing against black girls, but I don't either. Nah, this I don't sound like them. It's it's just it's the relationship wise and all the bullshit that comes with it. Because a lot of black women don't understand how to tone some shit down and act a certain way. I'm not trying to make you not be it's you. All racist. Honestly, I'm not trying to make you not be you. Black women are beautiful. They're beautiful. So don't get me wrong. They are queens. But I'm, it's just, it's the persona of what a black woman brings to the table as far as her mouth and her attitude because when she doesn't even have to be like that. You could have a Mexican girl and a white girl. You could have Hispanic, white, and and they going to try to act like if they're a black girl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And like, I done had a few of them, a lot of them. And I think I'm addicted to him. You know what I'm saying? Like Drake is addicted, addicted to naked to pictures and sitting and talking about bitches that he almost, almost had. had. <laughs> nah, for nah, for real. Like uh, we do a party. I think I'm addicted yes. to like girls. Like okay, if a black girl talk quote unquote ghetto, that's natural. Yeah. And it's fucked up for people to think like that. Yeah. But if a white girl or a Mexican girl is talking like that, that kind of turns me so on. So basically what he's trying to say is he like hood chicks because that's the same I line. mean, I do like hood chicks. I done that's had the most. That's I the had, ones that talk like that is the hood I white had, chicks, the hood Mexican I chicks. I had black bitches in middle school and high school. You know what I'm saying? I had black girlfriends. I don't mean to call y'all bitches. Or I said like the same that. shit in my head. But like... I had black girlfriends and, and stuff like that in middle school and high school. I had shit. one. One with big booty, one with extra large titties. I had you know one that was, she had one a, with extra large titties, no ass. I one had with one that had black skin, but a white girl body, boy. No ass, no titties, but she, she was beautiful as a black woman. And she was cool. I like that because you know me. But I my, don't like, my vibe wasn't the same vibe as hers, and I, ain't, I couldn't do it like that. What you know was what crazy is the crazy part, it ain't the black, the black part. It's the I don't like that big booty shit. <laughs> I like big boots, but not the fake ass stupid. Not I like Mm-mm. the 2010 plus back boots, uh-huh. but them 2015s and, and my bitch gonna be bad already. 2015 and before, but the 2015 up boots, I don't like them. My bitch gonna be bad already. 
Tell me, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to have niggas looking at her already. Yeah. Then you trying to get some work done to it? Hell, I don't, nah, hell nah. nah. But I mean, like, this, I was trying to, t- like, we had that discussion the other day, and I was telling the other day, at the end of the day, she a grown woman, I'm a grown man. I don't know if I can hear Why don't you just pull woman? that bitch to you, son? I can't. Right here. Take this and slide it to you. Uh, nah, because I don't want that bitch all in my face and I'll be motherfucking It's in your that face shit. now. Yeah, it's in my face now. But, but I got to hear you, though. But, uh, like, it's on a sense of, like, we are, like, <clears throat> I didn't, I got with you for you and who you are. You may have, before I met you, you may already have plans of wanting to change your body. You feel me? You may they have one do. of the. They exact, all do. You may have one of the fat she ass. She did. You want, and I can't. I, me, I'm not changing because guess what, baby? You can't change me. It's Kobe Bang, baby. Nah. I always stay the same. A lot baby. of y'all women, sister, speaking on that. A lot of y'all women don't even need nothing, man. Y'all don't realize that y'all born y'all the way that y'all born. You know what I'm saying? We're all born the same With way that we're supposed to be. With a big dick, however you gonna take us, how we gonna take saying? us. So y'all don't have to look Y'all always want to look like somebody else You're not born to look like somebody else You're born to look like you So stay looking like you Stop trying to be fucking Looking like somebody else Because the person you're trying to look like You'll never be that person Because that's not you You're you Stay you You know what I'm saying A lot of, a lot of that women And men too sometimes Don't even understand that shit When you go to yeah, fuck up your body You're like changing your and shit. You're changing your mold You're changing what the fuck You're supposed to be You're no that's longer like, you That's like getting tattoos you know, God made us with no tattoos. The tattoos, I can understand that. But we still changing our body. We're still changing fucking, the, this is a temple. Yeah, but we're changing how our body looks, not how our body feels. Cause, which is the same thing, feels and looks, when you change your face and everything else, because it's how you feel, how you, you look, too. look, yeah. Yeah, but I understand it, but you're changing something internal. This is external, this ain't shit. We can always, it is external. If I go to the doctor, get my, big, my dick bigger, you feel me, that's mm-hmm. external. And that's how it looks, not how it feels. Because well, we're not talking about women and what they're yeah, doing. Yeah, women. Though. But I'm just that's why I'm saying tattoos, nah, bro. That's but I know whatever, the only whatever. thing why I said tattoos is because, like I said, this is our temple. We're in a temple right now. And what? In our body, this is our. God no, said, I know. This is I our said, temple. I said, and what? Changing your ass and your titties is fucking up your temple. Yeah, you may want to go bigger and larger and shit like that. Okay, but that's so getting high is fucking good. up your temple. Drink is fucking up your temple. Yeah, Everything fucks yeah, up so your temple. So we can't judge. I'm not judging shit, but I'm just saying that it's not judging. Not, yeah, nah, for it's sure. saying, it's not judging. why are you changing the way that you're question. supposed to look? You know what I'm saying? That's not how you're supposed to look. You're supposed to look how you look, how you were born. What you're grown, what you're born with, what you grow up with. That's how you're supposed to be. That and ass is that women. ass, and them titties is them titties. I don't give a fuck if ain't nothing there. That's really how I like it. You, you know, know what I'm saying? tired of? Not like there ain't nothing there. You I'm gotta tired have of the body. same pose from women. It's the same backshot pose okay. of that ass, bro. I'm tired of that shit. Yeah, okay, I'm tired of asses. Ass has been out That's for me saying, for about a year or two now. You know what I'm saying? I'm tired of the ass. I'm an ass man, I'm a titty man too. But I'm tired of the goddamn, the, 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 I'm talking about not the ass, but the ass ass. The one that go, you know what I'm saying? The you walk go, in the door, the ass brr. still outside. That's yeah. how I be, you know what I'm saying? Sure. That I shit. can hit that. Oh yeah, you want to? Yeah, yeah, you light it first though. Oh, cause I want to hit that hoe with you. Yeah, cause if I hit that hoe, you ain't it's gonna, gonna hit it gone. after me. It's gonna be gone. Smoke it till it's all gone. Nah, because after smoke the sentiment, don't let me cap gone, after a nigga. certain part. Shit, that nigga don't smoke. Them niggas throw him. Yeah, that nigga throw him that big. God damn it. Nah, so I did it. I left it this big this morning because I figured that if you was to wake up and you came he in did here, respectfully, I did hit that hoe. Did so you seen it in the thing? Nah, you lit it up for me. You no, I'm drive. saying that when I was in the shower and shit, I left it. Oh, I didn't you. wake up when you was in yeah, the shower. Yeah, I know. Shower. You got up. Yeah, no, you yeah. did. You Afterwards, though. I'm talking away before I got in the shower. I'm sorry. I had uh, left the piece for you, and I had the yeah, new one sure. with me. You know what I'm saying? I was, I was looking out for my nigga. Exactly. Well, exactly. That. We got to look out for each other. That's why I say shit. We need to get a real old. You got weed? Duh. Got what weed? What you talking about? Got some blood? You got it. Like, ha ha. No drick drag, no zigzag. You know what I'm saying? Of the wood. You know what I'm saying? You remember the wood? It's been a minute since I seen the wood, but yeah. That's when Stacy, that's what Stacy. Oh, Stacy. Yeah, Stacy, yeah. that's what Stacy, Stacy the brother. Yeah, the nigga. Yeah, yeah the with blood. his hair. Yeah, he like, yeah. he like sit in the back seat. You know what I'm saying? When they on the wall. Yeah. And, and the nigga, he's like, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And he threw off the cops and shit like that because they was finna find a gun yeah. and shit. And he, that's how he yeah. was cool and he was able to date his the sister. Nah, he the one that smacked his sister ass. Yeah, hey, he was bum, supposed bum. to whip his and ass. And the nigga say, oh, here's Stacy in the face. Ooh. Yeah. 
I know, I already yeah, know that. That's shit. like when we was in Beaumont and that nigga, uh, fuck with that nigga, to JR or some shit. I forgot what the fuck that nigga name is. But we a little, he stole my bike. And he was trying to holler at my sister. Okay, Debo. You know what I'm saying? He was, yeah, for real, for real. They stole my bike. And the world, they stole your bike. And I'm like, nigga, you letting us steal my the bike? Big bro, what the what? fuck, man? Nigga, God, I lied to me, but I ain't going to lie to nigga older than the nigga. You know my sister. You know how she used to be. We ain't going to call her out. Yeah, but, yeah. But nigga, nigga, say, boom, hit me in the chest. I said, boom. I, but I took that hoe. But I ain't gonna lie, I started crying. <laughs> you know, I used to get mad though. It was a crying because it hurt. It, it was, was crying because I wanted to. Yeah, I wanted to kill. I used to be, Not, bro. Like you said, I had everybody. Now I want to kill your bitch ass. What the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> you lucky you stole my bike, bitch ass. Nigga, I'll ride to the house right now. Go get that knife. You heard me? I already know which one. <laughs> that that nigga like, love a knife, nigga. Was, yeah, I love a knife more than I love a gun, man. That yeah, nigga that love shit. a knife. Man, where I go get that bitch right now? That's how I knew I was crazy though, because I like, I, 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 you know what I'm saying? Get him, get him, get him. You feel me? I knew it. I knew I was dumb. I knew that there was something wrong with me. You feel me? The right yeah. there, because like, it was even before then, because I always go to it. Like I could strangle your bitch ass, but just the, just the, <laughs> and just the, just the, 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 the feeling of the like the bitch. I just ah, you know what I'm saying? Nah, nah, you know what I'm saying? This nigga it was crazy. Like arousing, you feel me? It was like arousing to me ever since a young nigga. You know what I'm saying? Just like how you told me, you told your mama, I this I'm gonna either do this in life and I'm gonna catch me a body before I die, right? Yeah. The same thing. I'm gonna have to carve me a pumpkin one day. You know what I'm saying? Okay. For shit show. So I get it, you know what I'm saying? Which is crazy to say, but as a kid, you know what I'm saying? I've always told my mom that for one, I was gonna be on camera. I, I mean, for sure, that was always gonna always be. Gonna be a Another star. thing, I was always gonna have a business. I have always wanted a business. I, I know I always wanted a family. And then the third but thing, I always told my mama, and she'll tell you to this day, man. Like, I've always told my mom. I don't know what the feeling it is, but I always told her like, before I die, I know I'm gonna have to take somebody's life. And it's crazy to say, sad to say, and shit like that. But like. I know that before I die, I'm gonna have to take somebody's life. And I accepted that shit. Am I saying I wanna do the shit? No. But yes. <laughs> it's 50 50. I'm not gonna lie to you. It sounds like some cynical, no, crazy ass shit, but I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, everybody, I feel like yo, everybody has that feeling, honestly. Because, I've thought of like, a lot of shit, man. I've thought of a lot of crazy shit. I just ain't never acted on it. I knew I was gonna be stars because, like, you can ask Christina, you can ask my mama, what do you want for your birthday? I, you remember when I lived in, when, in Shepherd? Yeah, my birthday, and I ain't get to do what I want for my birthday, and they was picking on me, Brittany and Noel and all them. So I took the baseball. This is how you know I'm crazy. A fucking baseball, nigga. I'm standing. You you remember the hallway? Brittany's door was at the end of the hallway, yeah, yeah. and then my mama's wall was right here in the living room type shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You hit that. You hit by the fridge, whatever that little to get yeah. in her room in the kitchen and yeah, the yeah, dining yeah. room. I took the ball, Brittany talking shit. I, wham. The nigga, I swear to God, perfect. Right where her head was at. If she ain't close that door, they're gonna knock her bitch ass out. I swear to God. <laughs> nigga, right there, mom. Uh, you're not gonna do what you want, and you're not getting your chain. My chain? Well, shit, we'll pass that bitch up today. You know what I'm saying? Take me to Home Depot. I'll get that bitch fixed. You know what I mean? <laughs> you don't know no shit. You know what I'm saying? But you couldn't take my chain away. I always had to have me a grill, fake or whatever. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, of course I had a fake grill because I was yeah, little. At that I'm, age, yeah. I'm like nine, six, some, some, I'm young than a 2007. Bitch. That's when I came out here. You were 18. I was eight years old. I was 19. 18. Because I asked you in the restaurant, I said, how old are you? You said, I'm 18. And I told you, I said, 18? You're only 10 years older yeah, than me. Yeah, because you was eight. Yeah, I was eight. I know. Remember, that was a conversation was we had. 14 years ago, I remember ago, bro. exactly where I was standing. I remember exactly what, where you you was in the mirror. I think you was combing your hair or some shit. Because remember, you used to have a long hair. Yeah. I think you was fucking with your hair and shit like that. And I was like, I'm at the door. I'm like, so how old are you? Oh, I'm 18. I'm doing a math in my head. Looking around. Oh, so you ten years older than me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You must be eight. Yeah, for sure. Show. I remember that because like we blood and everything, but like it's crazy to say. But the first time I actually kind of met him and fucked with him was whenever they came down for Hurricane and it was Katrina. My, it was my it was my brother's birthday. Hurricane but Katrina too. My though. mama was like, "What?" It, no, it was around. I think it was around my birthday when I. When y'all moved around, because I asked him, no, nobody no, before know. we moved out there, I'm saying, but the first time yeah, nah, that y'all yeah. came was Hurricane yeah, yeah. Katrina, yeah. and after that, we linked up, and that's how we all ended up moving out here to Bama. What, what people, what, I don't know if you understand or anything like that, my mom was like, what do you want for your birthday? And I was in New Mexico with y'all, and I was like, 
And like, are we vibing? We just made the tarp slip and slide and shit yeah. like that. My mom was like, because I'm out there for my, what do you want for your birthday? And I was like, shit, honestly, I want my Aunt Greta, Jay, and Nick to move out here. For real? Like, yeah, for sure. You I can ask my mama. You can ask her. She's like, and that's we really what you want? did that shit. She's like, that's what you want? And I was like, yeah. She's like, I talked so to her. That's probably why my mama moved out there because your mama, mama talked to my mama I'm, and she I, moved I'm out there. I'm telling you why, bro. I told her that's what I want. She's like, what else do you want? And I was like, that's what I want. Like, for sure, for sure. And she's yeah, like, I all right. That, she's bro. like, all right, I'll do that, but what else do you want? Because that's free. She's like, that's free. And I was like, shit, you know what I mean? Well, fuck it. If I could get another present then shit, I'm going dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Not that's dumb necessarily because we ain't have that. no money. You know what I'm saying? We, yeah, we, in a hood house, yo, we in a hood house, you know what I'm saying? Section 8, you feel me? And we got Nick with Britney, you Chanel in my shit, and Aunt Greta and Noel shit, you feel me? Like, nigga, we had a, we talk about a full house. We had a full house. We had a full house, and we all comfortably, happily living together. Well, who was your mama with at that time? Isaiah. Was, was Isaiah at that yeah. time? Yeah. I'm but he sure. wasn't in New Mexico he, with us, though. Nah. Yeah, it was just you. Mm -hmm. I mean, your mom and Christina. Because remember, we went to Dallas, and I broke the shit at Isaiah's shit, and I was coming out. Kaylee didn't break it. Kaylee caught the ass whooping for it, though. <laughs> <laughs> you let like, Kaylee take the shit man, for I'm it? Man, I'm tired of getting ass whoopings, and then the shit that, <laughs> shit that Kaylee be doing. I got to call my cousin, be like, hey. The shit that Kaylee be doing and shit, shit. Yeah. You know, they going to let her slide, because, you know, my uncle been in prison, yeah. and they trying to love her for... You know, they trying to love her for her, ourself and my uncle. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. And and it was on it was on a sense of shit, man. We was all out there, shit. You know me, I'm wild and crazy, but I didn't think it was gonna break. None of us thought it was breaking. I went to go motherfucking get myself up, got myself up, and the bitch said, "What was it that broke again?" It was a water fountain. But I didn't know back then. The enough. apartment that he was he was and at, Dallas, whatever he, he was, was trying doing to be a police, yeah. yeah. And nigga, cause look. Yeah. I mean, that's back then before I knew that they use fiber like the the shit that you make fiberglass with the little net and shit yeah. and then they put the motherfucking semen around all flimsy and shit yeah. I didn't know that's what the fuck it was I thought it was really <laughs> I thought that was semen like really there yeah that shit crazy bro I thought it was really there you feel me like I didn't think that that shit was finna fall like that nigga what man say, look it's standing like this three tears I grabbed the second tear boom that nigga Isaiah fucked me, bro. They're like, boom. Fuck the nigga Isaiah. I love him, man, but he fucked me. Look, man, you already. I'm, he fucked me over that house, that, bro. Not even the house, the bro. The two story house. Yeah, that was a good I come gave up. that nigga bread, bro. That was still a come And up. I went and I fixed the whole thing, bro. Yeah, it was, was a bunch of hoes from top to bottom, bro. Your room, the Wells room. Oh, yeah, you know my shit had hoes. I went and fixed it. I don't know, but this is like, this one, y'all living it, though. I don't think this This was like way after y'all. Somebody oh, else after had. After the people had moved out. Yeah, after the people and they I had got moved that out. patio and shit. Bro, because, you know, I was going to get my settlement and shit, you know what I'm saying? So I was going to buy that bitch, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, that's a good house, though. I love that house, and then my back mama. I love mama, that house. I the ain't kids, wanna move. The kids had that. They loved that house, bro, because uh, they had the it had a the trampoline still in the back. Yeah, yeah, it had a trampoline in the back, bro. But it's like I got a nigga a thousand dollars. Supposed to give him eighteen hundred, but he's like, man, keep the eight hundred for fix up the house. I was like, okay, bet. But you know what? I ain't gonna lie to you. He did that, and I'm. It's gonna all come out. He fucked he, me, bro. He fucked just you to get some money. He needed money because guess what? That wasn't his shit. I know. My mama just gave him the okay to take care of it while we was uh -huh. over here. And he was like, oh, I'm a I talked to your mama too, though. Well, at the time, kind of talked to Because I said, mama. mama, you know that. Because now it came to a point where I was turning eight. Remember, I told you, I was turning 18. We, I was out there with you working. Uh uh. Come on. Fast that shit here. I can still save up. it, man. Come yeah. on, man. Fuck it. We, it's a little podcast. I can't see how you do that. <laughs> okay, I'm a real nigga, nigga. I used to. Nigga, I done. Hey, Burn my up. shit. Nah, I ain't gonna bring your shit. You almost did. I was watching it. You see my eyes? You was eyes watching was it like, burn. Yeah. Nah, I was watching it. <laughs> that nigga was doing the usher, nigga, letting mm. me burn, goddamn me. I did it, you. What I did? Earlier, whenever you watch my shit, motherfucking fall. fall. Hell but yeah. not burn. Should not break. I could not be hearing shit right now. But it didn't fall. I mean, it didn't break it or did burn. It did fall. It didn't break, it didn't or, break or burn. A, it didn't break or burn nope. either. <laughs> Let's wipe this out So look I gotta check my YouTube but, channel I'ma check my shit While I'm on it You know what I'm saying The shit with y'all I need that I don't right, even know why I, do I think that shit's about to stop Honestly bro Cause we already Almost at goddamn 60 minutes Alright well stop that shit Let me go grab something Real quick so I can come back I wanna start back I a big old yeah, box in my hand going. Alexander right, McCoy So we're we gonna take a little intermission uh, okay. We'll be right back Back when we was talking about with Back that, to the police situation that, man. We Isaiah not finna shit. go outside And motherfucker Isaiah's an op too He a that police Isaiah shit That's what we talking about He still the police shit With the house bro That nigga fucked me with the house man 
Oh, for sure. I get a nigga that money, bro. First, get the house. I remodeled it. My kids fell in love with the house. They still talk about the house to this day. And then we had goddamn the niggas story. knock on the door. Talking about they uh, tax, to collect and, shit. and yeah. tax shit, all this other shit, bro. And it's like, how many people in the house? Like, they really ask the questions. And I had to I ask that nigga, like, that you gotta, I thought you had one left. Yeah. That's why I asked, asked you earlier, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. And that's why I say, you know, it's crazy because, look, it came to a point in time where I told my mom, I was like, look, I need the house. I didn't oh, I even know, I know you was living that. in that bitch. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And she's like, all right, well, if you could come up with this shit, this and that, and then you tell me you was living in that bitch. And I was like, well, never mind. She's like, what you mean, never mind? I was like, because Jay living in that house. She's like, Jay living in that house. Uh, I say, oh, uh, you always snitch on somebody on, on an accident. accident. <laughs> I'm always, not in a bad way. It's yeah. not an accident. Though. Like, I ain't just going to no laws and be like, hey, this nigga here still major dope. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, nah, don't do me like that, goddamn mm-hmm. me. But, you know, it was like, um, yeah, for sure, like, you know what I'm saying? And she's like, how he living in it? And I was like, uh, I don't know. And then it came to, she talked to Isaiah and then just came out. She's like, oh, no, everybody got me fucked up type shit. And I was like, well, uh, if all them feels, uh, I need a place to stay. <laughs> <laughs> and you living here I ain't going to give me no place to stay. You in a one-bedroom condo just so that way nobody could stay with your whole ass. Yeah. But shit, that's just what it was. Yeah, man, that nigga did me dirty, bro. Did me dirty, bro. Got a nigga, my, I remodeled the whole fucking house from top to bottom, bro. I was about to paint that hole and everything. I got the, all the mold out that bitch. Had I fixed all the holes in the walls. I took that nasty ass refrigerator out that had all that nasty ass food in it, bro. I did a lot of shit to that house. But that was from ba- us. I built a badass fucking fireplace. I mean, a, a goddamn fire pit in the back, bro. You should have seen that hole. I don't think you've seen pictures of that hole. Could, badass fire pit, we bro. We still go to it. On a, it ain't there no more. They on, took it out. Yeah, they took the bricks on this because that was a badass fire pit. Somebody seen that, took a picture, like, I'm finna take this bitch, go take it, go make it somewhere else. Cause it was nice as fuck. They had a bunch of bricks on the side of the house. A bunch of uh like fifteen by fifteen. I know what you're talking by, about. By uh inch and a half. I know. Red, bricks and huh? shit. No, they weren't red. Nah. What color were they? They were all white. White or gray, whatever. Fifteen by fifteen big ass bricks and um not bricks, but you know, slabs or whatever of bricks or whatever. They, they was there. So, I, but when I was nah, they weren't there. there. Mm-hmm. Okay, something I'm different. Finished, yeah. Whoever had the house left them there. So when I got the house, I was looking at them houses. I was like, what the fuck can I do with them? So I thought about it. I was, like, was going to make a fire pit. So I dug a little hole. I actually put the bricks down and made a circle and dug well, I dug the hole and then made a circle around it. And then I was like, I have a bunch of more bricks left. So I was like, fuck, what I could I do? So I made a badass seating area around it, a walkway. I put some goddamn uh, lanterns in that bitch around it. I made seating. It was bad as fuck, bro. I used to go out there and sit and smoke and just chill, bro. With my dog that I had. It wasn't even my dog. It was a little white girl dog that my baby mama thought I was fucking. Which I ain't even fucked the hoe. I should have fucked the hoe, though. She lived down the street? Nah, she lived at the apartments with us. And her and her nigga used to go to the house with me whenever I had that bitch. They was like, I told her I have the house now. They was like, okay, I don't believe you. Now I took him. I was like, nigga, you ain't just got a house. Now you got a house house. We motherfucking playing hide and go seek in that bitch, bro. Oh, yeah, you can hide. Yeah, we yeah can everywhere in that bitch, bro. We play hide and go seek in that hoe, bro. Had and then I took, the, ba- I took the, the white girl over there by myself, bro, and the baby mama thought I fucked, but I ain't even fucked the hoe. I probably could have, but I didn't. And I should have did it, bro. Honestly. Sad to say, but it sounds fucked up. I should have did the shit, but I didn't. I ain't passing them no pussy. I don't give a damn. <laughs> I'm for real. I ain't passing that them nigga no That nigga saying passed the pussy. No P U S S Y. I'm Kobe P. <laughs> Kobe P. Kobe Pussy. Mm-hmm. Kobe the player. Kobe the pimp. Kobe whatever the fuck. You could call Kobe me Pussy. Pop stack, goddamn yeah. pussy. Kobe Papa Doc, Papa Lock. Mm-hmm. Papa you Duck. Popping shit. Goddamn me. Shout awesome. out to Papa Duck. I learned a lot from that nigga. If y'all don't know who Papa Duck is, he got a podcast. He has a YouTube channel. He has a lot of shit, but it's Papa Duck, man. Check that nigga out on YouTube. I've learned a lot of shit from that nigga. A lot of shit that threw my head off and threw my mind and got me to the way I am now. Got me as smart as the fuck as I am right now. And what got me getting my goddamn credit up. <clears throat> Shout out to Papa Duck on everything. Nah, for shit show. Real talk. Real talk. Damn, we don't be talking about all goddamn types of shit, nigga. It's been coming fluently, but I think this podcast shit gonna work for us, nigga. I don't know if it's me or you can hear me or barely I I keep trying to tell your ass. Hey. You see how mine is compared to yours? That's what or, I'm trying to say. Or is mine I think 
Nah, yours is louder than mine. I'm the top. Yeah, I know. Your sh- I tried to tell you your shit was low. What about now? Yeah, see, now it's coming up bigger. Yeah. Uh, but then again, too, whenever you talk, you don't be like straight in the mic. You always be I'm like, always, yeah. Yeah, you always back here and shit. But shit, you know, it's our first podcast. We ain't tripping into anything. I can always turn your volume up. You know what I'm saying? Right here and shit, I can always turn you up. But I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna fuck with it right mm-hmm. now. But yeah, I don't know how much y'all gonna even get to this, the ending of this or to even this part right now. But shit, appreciate it. Appreciate it if y'all did make it out to this point, man. You know what I'm saying? This is a long podcast. A lot of people attention span is fucked off. They're only trying to watch not even five, ten minutes of your shit. Not even a couple minutes. They just want to always watch what they want to watch. But shit, this is a podcast. When you have a podcast, you're supposed to listen to the whole thing. You want to be high and listen to some shit, tune in. Yeah, exactly. High things. High things. Get fucked but up. Let's get on to the motherfucking goddamn meat. Uh, What's up? The beef. The beef. It's just everybody. <sighs> we don't have so much beef shit that happened within the past three weeks or the we month that I've been out here. No just... Nah, ain't no name, Sean. You know what I'm saying? But it's just. No free clout. It's. it's the beef shit, it's like, okay, you have a lot of niggas out here who want to claim they're this and want to be this and want to be that. And then when you pull that whole car and you show them what they're really not, they have no choice but to accept that shit. But now they want to be like, oh, you a whole ass nigga, I'm going to kill you because now you expose they bitch ass. But it's not even that. Like, all the beef shit that we've been going through, honestly, it really ain't been our fault. The only thing that was like my fault was the shit that happened at Kroger's, which... I was only respecting a woman and, and, and taking up for a woman. You know what I'm saying? This dude sat there and I was walking next to his lady to come out the end of Kroger's on the aisle and he walked past the end cap. If a lot of y'all who don't know who the end cap is, at the very end of the aisle, it's that spot at the very end of the aisle that has all the products at the very end. That's the end cap. And so he walked past that bitch and he almost bumped her. And I'm like, hold up, my nigga. Like, you could at least say excuse me. She's like, she looked at me. I was like, no, nah, no, nah, not you. I'm like him, and this nigga was on the phone with me the whole time. Yeah, I was, and I'm like, hold on, put me, uh, look at your phone real quick. He's like, yeah. what? I this is like, after we I got do, into do, it with the do, nigga. Do, 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 do. You know, that's the FaceTime sign. Yeah, do, 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 after do, do, I got into do, 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 it with this nigga. So when the nigga <coughs> passed, I'm like, damn, you could have said, excuse me. He's like, he looked at me, and he was like, I ain't gotta say a motherfucking thing. I was like, so bro, I said, man, you gotta respect the woman. He's like, bro, I ain't gotta respect shit. I ain't gotta do shit. I'm like, goddamn, my nigga, you don't respect women. He's like, bro, I got a six-year-old daughter. I'm like, okay, my nigga, you should respect your goddamn daughter because shit, if a nigga like me or anybody would have did some shit like that to her, you'll be pissed off and everything. Nah, for real. You know what I'm saying? He's like, yeah, for real. He's like, yeah, I I mean, I was like, you'd be pissed off and everything. And he's like, whatever, whatever. I ain't got to do shit. So I'm like, I'm walking. I'm in front of this nigga. Fuck you too then, nigga. And um, I seen he had bitters. I said, bro, you already fucked up as it is, my nigga. So don't get fucked up even more. He's like, so what's up? What you want to do? So I'm like walking on the side with him. And I kind of walked in front of him. And he went to go. I had a little rag on my shoulder. You ain't got it on you. Yeah, yeah, it's right here. You brought it in? Yeah. So I had this rag on my shoulder. I go his lucky rag. You know what I'm saying? I had that it rag on my all shoulder. The motherfucking beef. I, I keep telling him, man, you need you a regular coronavirus mask, man. Leave <laughs> no. that shit alone, no. man. Mm-hmm. Fuck that. He want to come around bandana, big old bandit and shit. That nigga I be, look like a nigga going to do something. What? I'll be so scared. Look, the the nigga, nigga, we go into the gallo. This nigga got the motherfucking bandana on. Everywhere I'm we like, go. Fuck, bro. Look. Hey, take us out, the man. Gallo is, that's the gallo we yeah, that's the guy low, real. But shit, man, so look. The guy low is the guy low, man. It's where we shop till we drop. You hear me? <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real. So the nigga go to grab my goddamn shit. He's like, he walking behind me. He's like, so I see you got this rag. And he goes to touch my rag. I'm like, bro, don't, if you touch my motherfucking rag or you touch me, bro, I'm going to beat your bitch ass. So he's like, what's up then? What's up then? What's up then? I'm going to phone my cousin. So I'm laughing. I'm like, bro. Mind you, I have my pistol with me. I ain't gonna lie to you, I have my pistol with me. You know what I'm saying? For sure, so. And so I'm like, okay, I'm in Kroger right now, my nigga. I can't fight this dude because if my pistol fall out, they're gonna think I'm trying to kill this nigga or they're gonna try to put a nigga in jail. Or he might pull his pistol out and try to shoot him because, you know, you know I know if I get in a fight, a nigga gun fell out of shit. I knew that if I whooped this nigga, he was gonna shoot me some shit. I'm just gonna go ahead and end the fight. I'm just gonna shoot you then and then. You know what I'm saying? Fuck so, it. the nigga, your phone ringing. So, the nigga. I, know, I uh, silenced that hoe. Oh, okay. So. The nigga, so I, I'm talking to my cousin and shit, and I'm like, bro, I'm not even entertaining this nigga, bro, so I'm going to walk off. I'm going to look for these chips I was looking for because we was finna make a spread, my first spread ever, which shout out to the spread. He made, I fucked with everything but the goddamn cheese. But that was just me. I ain't never had a spread before, so the, it probably was good as fuck, but you know, I just didn't fuck with the cheese like that. But anyways, so 
the nigga time I, I see the nigga at the end of the, the, the aisle he's like looking at me he's like bro I see you seeing me so I'm like okay bet so I told my cousin I was like, bro, I'm gonna put my phone in my pocket, bro, because I don't want to walk out the store and this nigga sneak me without with me having my phone in my hand. And I got this bag in my hand and shit like that. This nigga ain't finna sneak me. So I go outside. The nigga, uh, I see the nigga sitting in his truck, and my truck, I got lights at the bottom of my shit. So I walk to my truck, and so the nigga, uh, he see me hopping my shit. So I pull off. I'm on the phone with this nigga the whole time. I pull off. The nigga pull off too. I'm like, bro, this nigga finna follow me. He's like, for real. I was like, yeah. So I bet I'm outside. Yeah. So. I'm coming, so I was like, I take the back cut to the stove, because we literally, literally right across the street from Coker's. So I take the back cut to the stove. I'm like, this nigga still follow me. He's like, so bro, you want me to grab the AR? I'm like, hell yeah, nigga, come outside. So he get the AR, he come outside. So where we live at, I'm ready. I'm ready. I was just told you I had the motherfucking. That <laughs> <laughs> shit. Yeah. That ain't what I want to feel, but fuck it. I don't got no knife in here, you hear me? Just a butter knife. And if I do that, oh, butter knife. A butter knife gonna fuck a fucking nigga Man, up. nigga, no. It's not gonna just fuck a nigga up. You gonna feel everything, because that shit dope. I gotta really come with it. Uh, uh, and then you got the ripples in that shit. Just cut the butter and spread that bitch, so you gonna... Nigga said cut the butter and spread that bitch. <laughs> That's how it's gonna sound. That's how it's gonna feel. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just, yeah. just do that. Just And feel it. What time you get the bread? At the 12? After 12, yeah. Whataburger. And that's a bit. Something. I'm hungry as fuck. I know we still got the little bullshit Burger King, but I'm hungry nah, as fuck. fuck that. I'm not eating that Burger King. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You He's... know what uh, Carlos said on, on the 85 South what show about Burger Shout King? Shout out to Carlos Miller. He said shit. He said, uh... You got to eat Burger King right then and there. Yeah, you can't. You can't That's drive like I home. told you earlier, nigga. I ate that little burger. That bread was oh, hard shit. as fuck. That you shit. was like, oh, you save one. You smart, smart. And like, nah, nigga. Like, literally, you know, I'm not even finna eat this. This is how I feel about did I know, shit. Yeah. Like, you know, shit. This shit finna be there and shit. That's it. You already ate my wings, so shit. <laughs> nigga, I ate two fucking wings, my nigga. Did I not give you? I ain't gonna lie. Hold I'm up. just bringing that shit up because uh, <laughs> I, just because it's something to fuck with you with. I'm did gonna, this, did because I'm look, not. I told you, I said, these are my wings now. You got your own goddamn wings. Oh, look, up. though. When I got that Waffle House. That's cool enough. Not the first time, because the first time I ate that shit, because the nigga time, was yeah, sweet. I say, hey, nigga I need some smack hash shit. browns. Yeah, I got it. I got double hash, hash browns. browns. I got only, a bunch of eggs. You know, I don't eat pork, so hash browns only. I know you're going for it. some steak or some mm-hmm. pork or some pork chops. hash browns. That's all I got. And, and, and I ain't going to lie, so I'm going to tell you how I did you, since we want to be honest. I ain't going to lie. So I knew your ass was asleep. So when I came in the house, I was tiptoeing. Because <laughs> I was he like, didn't want me to wake up. I was like, I did. I was like, look. I had drunk in a bitch I anyway. I hope this nigga don't wake up, bro, because I want to really fuck this whole plate up by myself. I did have some for you. If you was up, you would have got your goddamn portion. Waiting on you. I should have been like the mamas I, when I you walk in. I thought you was, because I just got off the phone with this nigga before I pull up. The Waffle House is not far. Like five, ten minutes. It's like down 10 the street. Minutes. I just got off the phone with this nigga. When I walked in, I, saw, I, I, I stopped. He ain't on the phone. I say, yeah, I'm gonna fuck this whole play up by myself. I was quiet eating that whole, but that See, shit was I ain't good. had like the TV, like y'all don't know the setup, but the TV, we only got one TV in this motherfucker. The TV was in the living and room. We don't even watch TV. And we don't even watch that bitch. So like when he go back to Beaumont to see his kids, I be wanting to go, but shit, I don't want to be intruding on my homeboys or anything like that. Yeah, cause I don't, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going with you. I'm not going with him over there. I'm not no cock black ass nigga, you feel me? So I'm not finna go with him or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Just leave him in my and, house. I, and not only that, I always tell him, man, drop me off over here. And he be like, man, if you get dropped off over here, man, if I don't go pick you up. And I'm like, man, what shit? I, I always don't wanna... pick you up no matter yeah, what. Yeah, though. he do, but I just don't I like still... it. I don't, this nigga always want to move around and do some shit, man. <laughs> They'll never stay goddamn shit. I gotta move around, shit. I'm in a city <laughs> where I ain't been in a minute, so shit. I gotta, like, like the last time, remember, I, the last time I went to Beaumont, I went broke in Beaumont. I ain't gonna lie to you, nigga. We, I took care of Noel. I took care of... That's how we had a casino. It was, nah, I don't remember. I think we... We, we did man. casino. We went to casino. Yeah, the we next day, y'all went to... Y'all and then we went I was to, supposed to go that night, but y'all ain't up going yeah, the next we, day. The next day, we got a hotel. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Holiday Inn. I ain't never stayed there before. Man, that bitch is nice. I ain't gonna lie to you. Man, we went there right Jose, by Tinsel Town. I love that nigga, but fuck that nigga at the same time. I was like, I fuck with you, nigga. You my nigga. We been on just three. But we had a uh, two-story top and bottom with the, the, the spiral case stairs and shit at the goddamn holiday in a minute. Ooh. That shit was live, bro. Nah, see and they had I... jacuzzi in that hole, bro. Mm-hmm. And them niggas, Jose and goddamn Joseph, thought that was the shit. And <sighs> Tony Montana. Had, yeah, thought a, thought a little white boy, him, him and his little white boy and his partner walked up. And um, 
was talking to Jose crazy or something. So Joseph stood <laughs> back, and all of a sudden, them niggas just uh, hit that nigga. Nah, laid on. his ass out. Was hitting laid like, his ass in the hot Jose tub. was like, nigga, stop. Nah, he was outside, <coughs> outside the door. Jose was like, bro, stop, stop. And then there ain't no kind of laws on us, bro. So we ended up having to fucking leave that goddamn hotel before the laws come. We had a whole two story, nigga. It was me, Jose, nah, and Joseph. Was like a three penthouse bitches. hotel, though. Hmm? It's like a penthouse, but a hotel. That bitch slide, bro. We had the mirrors and behind that like bitch. Like suites for real. A jacuzzi in that bitch, bro. Uh, <laughs> that bitch is live. I ain't gonna lie. Let's go to Midland and try to get the hell again. How much was that room? I don't remember. I didn't pay for the room. Uh, Jose. Nah, nah. I don't even think they did it. I think it was the girls who had the room. Are y'all was with some bitches? Yeah, nigga. Three bitches and three and, and uh, us. I wouldn't even let no niggas in. Nah, we didn't let them in. We ended up walking out. We was, they were swimming and shit outside, bro. We were swimming and shit. We had to pull outside the jacuzzi in the room. So we were swimming and shit, and then Jose happened to see the nigga walk up, was talking to him, and his homeboy tried to plex, and we had me and Joseph with him. At the time, I, I wasn't like them niggas. Them niggas just knocking niggas out, just knocking niggas out. That's like not me. my life. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's how they was. Yeah. And so uh, Joseph hit that nigga, and the rest is history. And then it's crazy, because Jose was like, bro, now I'm like you, and now you like how I was, because I always, I always tell them niggas, like, hey, man, calm down, like, the shit y'all doing y'all I never been on no Like be when it comes to like Fighting this shit I never been on no Calm down shit Like you know what I'm saying I'd be on some If I'm on some calm down shit And a nigga wanna fight me I'd be like look man I ain't finna fight you man And I ain't even on no scary shit man What the fuck is we fighting for Yeah It's about some money It's about a bitch a bitch, <laughs> but a on. bitch. I think it sound like uh, goddamn plies. Man, if it's about a bitch, it's about you, a could, bitch. you can keep sound like that. Goddamn, uh, you can keep that hoe. Drake. Yeah. Well, he's like, you Drake. can keep that hoe. <laughs> <laughs> you can keep that little scallywag. I ain't worried about no bitches. A whole bunch of hoes out here. But you can't make them drink. He's like, you got to give a train, fuck about nigga. it. What my favorite saying? I don't give a fuck about a hoe more than the fish. Give a fuck about a raincoat. So shit, I'm not finna fight you over no bitch. You won. You could say you beat me up. Fuck it. I'm not. I ain't even. Nah, just like you know what I'm saying, it, like prime like, example where these niggas talking about fighting over a bitch. That's how my nigga Mo Three got killed, nigga. A bitch set him up. If you wanna fight me over a bitch, look, RP Mo Three, I, I'll RP have my it, man. You whoop me, man. That's my that's my L. RP shit. Nipsey. I got if that's the case, I got a bunch of L's. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because that's one thing I don't do is fight over no bitch. Now when you disrespect me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You may came over the bitch, but then you disrespecting me. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna yeah. let everybody know, hey look, I'm finna beat his ass. Ah, you fighting over no, I'm beating his ass because I'm finna beat his ass <laughs> disrespect. because he disrespected me. He could have came at me on a whole different way. He wanna be gangster, he wanna do all right. No well let's check this out, Papa. Look, hey, you said what you had to say, you did what you had to do. Yeah. Bop, bop, bitch ass <laughs> nigga, you ain't even it's over like yeah. I knew. Yeah, well, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Man, look <laughs> It ain't no scary shit or nothing like that, but shit, if you ain't prepared shit, you came at me disrespectfully, you got your hands down, you ain't prepared shit, I'm yeah. only going, I'm only, I'm only, you know, Subject to do what the fuck I'm nah, supposed not to even, do. Not even, not even that, like, I'm only like, uh, what well, I was going to say, like, uh, like wholesome, like, I don't, it's a S word. You find out you got a goddamn, you wholesome nigga. Man, like, I'm a wholesome man, but you what know. What S word? Man, like, uh, like. Like solid, basically. Nah, like, I don't want to say the wrong one. And like, <laughs> that that nigga don't know this shit. <laughs> like, like celibate or some shit like that. What's that shit? Celibate, like, nah. Celibate is when you ain't having no sex and shit like that. Yeah, and that's exactly. That's not what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, it's a, it, I know what I'm. It's at the tip of my word. You know what I'm saying? My tongue. You feel yeah. me? But like. Still, like I'm, I'm only gonna, you know what I'm saying. I'm gonna let you disrespect me so far, yeah. and I even let a nigga disrespect me or walk away. You know what I'm saying, just out of my character because I let you know what I'm me three times before I beat his ass. Like I let three you, times. I let you get away with a lot of shit. A lot you know of what shit. Saying? Because guess what? Because really, all, while you bumping your gums, I'm just plotting on you the whole time. Exactly, nigga. Like, why you, that nigga bumping you, three you, times? You're like, like you stand right here. Ah, oh, fuck you. That's that. Da, 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 da. Okay, yeah. Uh, fuck Thinking, me. Plotting. Fuck me. I'm looking at your mouth the whole time though. You think I'm looking at Ooh. your eyes? I'm, gonna hit your I'm, ass. I, I'm finna hit your nose. Fuck that. Yeah. I mean, what? Nigga, I see your mouth. I know I need to aim a little higher shit. And I'm at your nose. I'm finna have your eyes watering. That's one thing my grandma Maggie always told me. <laughs> hey, hit him, in the, time, hit him in the nose. Fuck it. Bam. Uh, out, nigga, hey, don't you hate when you accidentally get hit in the nose, your eyes start watering? That's what I'm hurt. saying. Your shit, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna hit you in your shit. I'm telling you, you hope, uh, you better hope I don't come up with it because I could really, uh, you feel you me? Off, and fuck yeah. your ass off, break all that shit. You could stab your brain. I could kill you just with my hands like that. But like, I be really plotting on just really just, uh, one time in your nose, you feel me? How one you water for the one time? Cause look, when, once I got your eyes watery, bitch, I'm hitting you with that other, uh, uh. 
You know what I'm saying? I'm hitting it's you. tomorrow, Wednesday. Tomorrow, Today's Thursday. Wednesday. No, today, today, Wednesday. Tomorrow, Thursday. No, I know, cause I oh, get paid yeah, yeah, yeah. at 12 o'clock. You're right. Okay. No, I was asking, because we were supposed to be dropping these podcasts. I was going to say every Thursday. I mean, every Wednesday, but shit. We can drop we this. making them every Wednesday. And then drop them Thursday? Fuck it. So you want to drop them every Thursday? Fuck it. All right, we do that. Because I ain't going to be no editing. It's just, you know, straight video. Matching up the audio. That's it. Throw the intro in that hoe. We need the intro and the outro. So we'll just Let's pick. play that shit real quick. What? They ain't going to really. Uh, I'm going to play it on my phone. Play what? I'm going to play it on my phone. One of the songs? Yeah. No, I can play it off here. But it's gonna play in here. It's gonna play in. This, it's gonna record though. The it's sound. gonna record. Yeah. Because sure? it's playing in this. Nah, it's playing in our headphones. Because in the studio, like you know, when oh, I have, so. it's playing in my headphones. So what we had to do is we gonna play it in here. I'm gonna speak it, and this is all on the camera. And then we just match the audio up, so y'all could just hear the sample, whatever part we want to put in there. Are oh, you talking about just play the song behind the audio? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Go ahead, play something. So we can so. Oh right, yeah, so we could even have to use your phone. You could just that's what say I said. I could just match it up with the yeah, audio. Yeah, exactly. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Or What's I could just use band, my huh? phone. Yeah, go to that uh, rocket. Where the fuck is a garage band? Uh, where's the rocket at? Nah, that's what I'm saying. It's not on here. Hold on. Oh, you ain't got the little thing on there though. It usually be on there though. It's you know the rocket. Yeah. It's a rocket that you click and shit like that. Yeah, pull up, bitch. Yeah, there is a guitar. Hey, save that for your home on your dock. Left click it and but save it. I the... know what to goddamn do. Well, look, check this out. I've had Bubba. a Mac for a long time. I so had one first. Macaroni, goddamn. I'm the reason why you got the Mac. Now I'm playing. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> I did talk you into it, though. No, you didn't to get the Mac? When? When I told you, man, the Mac is the way to go. I always told you that. Yeah, you but had I don't know. But you I'm told not the, me that. Yeah, but yeah. that's not the reason why no, I got I'm my not, Mac. I ain't gonna lie I said, but I talked to you. I talked. I put that word in your ear. You, I thought about it. I ain't gonna, because I, thought I about said it. it. <laughs> oh yeah. That's okay, why I well, play I that. About play that. Look, which extra, one? Look, look, please cancel. This gonna be the intro. Fuck this one. It. Yeah, we'll let this all play. Which one's this one? Yeah, profit. The intro. Uh, that bitch beat. That bitch beat. Did it got the earphones? Yeah, me too. Yeah, uh. yeah. <laughs> nah. It's right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What did I say? Fuck is you talking about profit? My, my niggas get it, it and you ain't got nothing. My niggas be thumbing through hundreds. Uh. Hey, yo, oh, you know that I'm clutching. Them niggas ain't clutching on nothing. You want my head, my nigga, nigga come bust it. My niggas, they thuggin'. I lost my little brother, you know what it is, so I just said, fuck, fuck it. it. Yeah, shout out my granny house. I'm trapped hard, fuck is you talking about? This ain't a waffle house. I'm cooking chickens and I had to sell it out. We keep the glizzy out. Uh, Cause they know my whereabouts Y'all talking too loud Need a pipe down I get it in nigga Then I should play loud Drink out my people now I'm trying to call Hey pause that. that Let me down That's all y'all get it man We gonna hit it We gonna hit another one You know what I'm saying Alright which one do you wanna hit next Another one Uh Nah Go uh Purse cancel Say easy or wait Go back to where you was Files Go to open recent Okay And then go to uh Yeah right there You Fuck love it. it Yeah Alright Loved me, not you loved me. Well, he says you love me. Because she used to love me. Damn. I can hear myself in the studio. I hear it too. Yeah. It sound like you don't Like I really in it, bitch. You know what I'm saying? But on the mic, it's gonna be different. But now we live, so they don't even know. Y'all can't hear the shit that we care. You only wanna fuck me. Okay. Touch me. (laughs) That shit's our love. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, let me see if it's picking it up, though. I can really, you know what I'm saying? It's picking it up, you that you me, but it's picking up as regular. It's not picking up as a audio. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, nah, it's not picking up. Nah, it's I'm, only picking up. It's my picking up for me because I'm first mic, and in the studio, it's open, so I'm first mic. Don't say that. Not gonna record as the auto tune. Don't say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They ain't recording nothing. You see, it's not moving. Nah. Yeah. So we have to match audio. You said that you love me, but only just to touch me, and I ain't feeling nothing. Whoa, whoa. whoa. So we're giving the whole thing. We'll let this whole thing run. The whole thing run for you. All right. We got to talk hard. I 
Hey, only if we had this sound in the podcast so they understand. Oh, yeah. This yeah, sound, yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. This one right here. I said that I love you when I'm in it. You love me, but I ain't feel shit. Lately, I've been running around really on some real shit. When I really drop the track, baby, you gon' feel it. My own lane, my own thing. Jimmy Kirk Cobain's Ah, uh, you like that one <laughs> Drink in my cup Okay I don't give a fuck <laughs> No, I ain't fucking with you nope. Baby, just tell me how you feel for real uh. Now you ain't fucking with me Tell me what is really real A <laughs> conversation of a kid didn't go so well And you know how I feel I say? So tell me what is real I can't wait on no whole playing games uh. I can't say no shit, I don't wanna say none. So I'ma just chill, I don't know how to feel, but I can chill. chill. All my niggas tell me that, that I need a chill. Uh, if you touch my cup, chill, I'ma chill. show you how I roll feel. Uh, it's not for real, what's the deal? Yeah, Maybe for real. Just keep, keep it real. real. Just keep it real. You said that you love me, but only, only kiss and touch, touch me. me, and I ain't feeling nothing. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. I see something different. I wanna give you children. It's not part of your vision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta play the other one next. Yeah, yeah. Which one? You know which one? Alright. I think we just played it. Oh, uh, yeah. But the, but the other one, though. The, uh, or is it this one? The, uh. No, nah, it's not this one. You know what I'm talking about? Though, yeah. The one you just made. Yeah, both of them. I, all three of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got a, uh. Got a, uh. Done? Yeah. Okay. I know. Go down. Go down. Mm, look the best. That's what it's called, my friend. And it's muted, so you ain't gonna be. It's raw, cut, and ugly. I'm gonna hit this, huh? So we got to play all these hoes at, on the. and match the audio up. Yeah, for sure, so. It's a real podcast right here, goddammit. Yeah. And the good yeah, thing I about it. I see that we doing the studio ourselves. I can't hear you. I said, you see that we're doing the audio ourselves, the studio, the studio. And the good thing about it, we yeah. own this bitch, so we can do whatever the fuck we want. Sundress, head down, you ain't got too much. No makeup on. That's just when you look the best. I, I hope, hope that, that you I don't can take you home. You ain't even tripping when your girl see you come along. You know where we dance soon as I make here, it home. Here, look, on the, on the left side. Yeah, right there. Bet. Back on this bitch. Yeah. That's why I make it home. Yeah. Look, don't put no makeup on. Sundress, head down, bottle with no makeup on. This is when you look the best. I hope that I can take you home. You ain't even tripping when the girls see you come along. You know I'll be there as soon as I make it home. Yeah. Don't put no makeup on It's that bang shit, no lame shit, yeah <laughs> It is Kobe Bang I'll never change and stay the same First time I met you, yeah, I see you looking at the mall Yeah, it's Kobe Bang, but I'm ballin' like I'm poppin' soft Steady in the game, so it's me to fingers tell you, I be going dumb Yeah, I'm tryna fall, yeah And all the songs that I've been dropping lately, it's, uh. I said, pause it real quick. All the songs that I've been dropping lately have <coughs> just been only a hook version of hook. Unless I'm on somebody else's shit. Oh, uh, okay, I got you. Like, fuck that. Oh, go play that one. Uh, Which one? My name. Fuck it. We, I make songs for everything. You can't say that I don't. Oh. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, that's my shit. I forgot about this. You put a verse now? No. Mute that. Mute that. Freeze it? Mute it. Mute the, uh, what, the audio that is this on? This one? Yeah, mute it. Nah, right there. Now go. Yeah, right there. I don't know who the fuck put that shit I think my dad did it. I right, did so? I want to hear it. This is too slow. Okay, well then, uh, unmute it. Let's see what, I think it's my dad. Say, baby, I love you. Are the feelings still the same, though? Uh-uh. I don't know. <laughs> Shout out to the cheap bill. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to keep doing that shit, so fuck it. We ain't even going to give them that one then. Uh, no, so fuck it. What we at? With an hour and 30 minutes already? Old long ass pocket. That's a whole new fresh? Nah, it's not fresh, but it's whole. <laughs> <laughs> what Feel time it? is 11.44? You ain't, uh, you got a little way to it. Uh, anyway, I just been go across the street real quick and get right now, baby. That store closed, though, huh? No, but not that, that show, though. That show open. What did, uh, fucking, uh, off of Friday, the nigga, the daddy, Red's daddy? No. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> go ahead. I'm be right here. What, you talking about the show across the street? The shed right there by Waterburger. Waterburger. I know what you're talking about, buddy. No. It's that bad? It ain't bad. I've never seen a cop there, bro. You know how many times nah, I drive around? I ain't a cop being there. So what's wrong with that store? It's That's the only store we can get beer from. If not, we got to go all the way down to the Exxon. What time is it? 11.44. We got to go now. You scared of drinking this one right here? That's not enough. For like what's the top buzz, cup? I'm trying to get nothing. Yeah, yeah I'm trying to drink, drink. And you only got that little... Uh, yeah, because I ain't want to spend no money. All right, well, we're going to wrap this up, man. <laughs> I got to go down the street oh. to get me a goddamn another beer. We're going to holla at y'all motherfucking goddamn later, man. <laughs> Shit show. <laughs> this is goddamn episode one of High Teams. Yeah, Talking high in every bumper way. And we out this bitch. Shout out.